the first feature is about using this back button as a shortcut to open different apps for example if i press this back button two times like this it will open the microsoft one note and here i can start taking my notes okay so here you can see now for example if i want to use the highlighter i can select the highlighter from here and i can highlight my handwriting now the next thing is you can also use it for creating different shapes so here i select this automatic shapes option and i just create this circle so here you can see it will make it neat the next thing is you can also use your surface pen for screen clipping so for example i just select this insert option i select this screen clipping option and now whatever i have on my screen i will just select it and it will automatically insert into my notes for example i have this anatomy part i will just select it like this and once i finish the selection it will automatically go into my notes so here you can see this part is now available in my notes the next feature is about pdf annotations so you can use your surface pen for pdf annotations so i will open this app name of the app is microsoft journal you can download it from microsoft store now here you can just open uh, one journal and then here what you can do just select this plus icon once you select it here you see this option of insert a pdf just select it once you select it here you can open your pdf for example i select this pdf and i will import it now here you can see it will import this pdf and here i can annotate this pdf using different tools so here you can see i can use this writing tool i can write on my pdf with my microsoft pen i can also use the highlighter option for example if i want to use the highlighter i can use the eraser option and then i can also use this scale option for example if i want to draw some kind of line okay so i will just use this if you want you can also add pages to your pdf as well so for example i have different pages now if i want to add a page i select this three dots option from here so here i just select these three dots now what i will do i select this option of insert page above so just select it once you select here you can see a new page has been added so this is my new page and here i can do all my annotations i can write here anything i can use the highlighter everything i can do over here so once you finish with your annotations you can also export your work so what you have to do again select these three dots on the side so here are the three dots just select it and here you see this option of export just select it you can export one page or you can export everything so i will just export all so here you can see you can export it to one note or you can export as pdf the next feature is about using your surface pen for web capture and then you can mark it up as well so for example i will open microsoft edge web browser here i will search heart anatomy and then here you see this first result i will open it now for example i want to uh, capture this part so what i will do i will press and hold the side button of my surface pen and i will tap on my screen now it will open a small window and here you see this option of web capture just select it once you select it here you can see it is asking me to capture the area so i will start capturing this part okay with the text and with this image like that so here you can see i just selected now what i can do is here it is showing the option of mark up capture just select it once you select it it will bring over here like that and then you can use your pen to point out anything for example if you want to highlight something if you want to write okay so you can do all your markup here the next feature is about using your microsoft surface pen as a laser pointer in powerpoint presentations for example i will open this file and then i will start presenting it now here you can see at the bottom we have this icon just selected once you select this pen icon the first 
option is about laser pointer just select it once you select it now you can use your pen as a laser pointer to highlight anything in your presentation for example i want to highlight like this i can do it if i want to use like this pointer i can also use so here you can see this is how i can use now you can also use it as a pen okay so i just select it and i select this pen option now you can write anything in your presentation so for example if you want to mention something if you want to point out something you can use it as a pen